One of the qualities of the Dhamma is open aiko, something to be brought inward, referred inward. In other words, the Buddha has us turn around and look inside at what we're doing, rather than looking outside at the results of what we've done and the results of what other people have done. Because it's only when we look inside that we see the workings of the mind and how it creates all these things to begin with, in particular how it creates suffering. So if you don't look inside, if you spend all your time interested in this person, that person, this whatever outside, you don't really see the Dharma. You just see the results of things, but you don't see the connection with the causes. And particularly, you don't see where the suffering is in the whole process. If you don't see the suffering, then you, you never get dispassionate toward it. You can never get released from it. You just find this interesting. You want to go there. You want to find out about this thing, that thing. Your knowledge just keeps going out, 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 out. And what we've got to do is bring it back in, in, in. We start with the breath because it's really close to the mind during the present moment. And then we begin to edge our way inward to get even more directly acquainted with how the mind shapes things, and all the comments it makes on things, and all the perceptions it applies to things, and the extent to which they're helpful and the extent to which they're not. So when you see the workings that you understand the machine, it's only then when you can take it apart. Otherwise, we just get carried away with the products that it produces. It's like a factory. Sausage factory, as Dickens once said, if you want to eat sausage, don't look too carefully at the process. So we're interested in the results, but that's by looking at the process that the Buddha says, we can get a sense of dispassion toward it. So we realize we don't need that anymore. There's something better. So always remember when anything takes your interest, okay, where is this taking you? Is it taking you out or bringing you in? If it takes you out, you've got a question, okay, so what, what are the long-term benefits of going out that way? What are the long-term forms of harm that can be caused, too? And then look back in and say, what is the mind? why is the mind going there? There was a time when one of the monks from Bangkok was visiting, what time was it? It was commenting on the beautiful sunset. And John Fung said, why do you look at the sunset? Why don't you look at what's inside talking about the sunset? In other words, that perspective keeps having to point back in inside if you're willing to see what's going on and if you want to find some freedom from it. 